Hi everybody, I'm Meredith Lawrence, the Blue Jean Chef, and this week we're previewing a recipe from the fish section from my new cookbook, Blue Jean Chef, Comfortable in the Kitchen. It's the basic halibut on papillote. I give you five papillote recipes in the book. That means cooking the fish wrapped up in parchment paper. Parchment paper is really all you need. Otherwise, it's the tiniest, easiest way to cook fish at home. Plus, I think it's one of the tastiest with a sauce built right in. The only thing I want to show you is exactly how to wrap it up in that parchment paper. So come on over here and you'll take a look. Here is our beautiful halibut filet in uh, on one half of the parchment paper. I'm just seasoning it well with salt and some freshly ground black pepper. And then I'm going to put the flavors on that I want. Some of the recipes in the book call for basil and tomato. This one is actually very simple. It's just some lemon slices, some fresh thyme, and we're going to put some butter on top, about a tablespoon of butter over the whole entire filet, just like this. And then what I do is I use a little egg wash around the outside of the paper. This does two things. First of all, it's going to help glue the paper together when I go to fold it, but it also helps to prevent the, egg, the uh, wine, which I'm going to add in a minute, from actually running out of the sides. Here comes the wine, about two tablespoons per filet. Just drizzling that on top there. You can see it beading on that parchment paper. And now here comes the folding part. This really is the only part you have to relearn. So I'm pushing the pages together like this, and here comes the first fold. The first fold, I take that corner and I just fold it over like that. The second fold, I'm going to start from the middle of the first fold and fold it like this. The third fold, start about an inch into the second fold and fold it again. I'm going to do this all the way around, just starting the subsequent fold in the middle of the next of the fold that came before it. You see how that works? Very easily. Now the egg wash is helping to keep these pages together and we're forming sort of a half moon here. Then at the end, I just sort of tuck that under and give it one last fold. This is ready now to go onto a baking sheet. You could have four of them on a baking sheet if you wanted to. And if you forget how to do this, look, all the photographs are in the Blue Jean Chef cookbook, so you'll be able to reference that easily. Now here's one, a finished one that we just did. It smells amazing, I've got to tell you. And the fun thing about cooking on papillote is you could actually serve this. The paper is going to be cool enough to touch. I could put this right onto a dinner plate if I wanted to and serve it like that. Just tear open. Careful, there's going to be steam coming out. But you tear open the top a little bit so everybody can see what's inside. Look at the beautiful sauce that's in there. You can serve it like that, sort of like a present on everybody's plate. Or you could take it out and put the sauce on at the end. So, 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 so very simple. The only thing you have to remember is how to do that fold. So that's it for this week. That's a recipe from the Blue Jean Chef cookbook, Comfortable in the Kitchen. That goes on sale October 31st in the Kitchen with David at 12 o'clock. I hope to see you then. Thank you.